Episode 2, Media. Are we controlling the story or is it controlling us? Think about the last video you watched or the last article you clicked. An AI algorithm likely put it in front of you. Media has always shaped how we see the world, from newspapers or radio to television and the internet. Each evolution of media changed not just how we share stories, but how we understand reality. Today, artificial intelligence is deciding which stories we see and which ones we don't. Scrolling through YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, or a news feed, and algorithms are choosing what appears. On the surface, it feels personalized and convenient, but over time, these invisible curators can turn into echo chambers. We stop discovering new perspectives, we start reinforcing our own. Our worldviews narrow without us even realizing. What begins as customization can quietly become manipulation. This shift brings us very real risks. Polarization. Algorithms feed us more of what we already agree with, dividing us further. Misinformation. AI generated deep fakes and fake news spread faster than fact checkers can catch them. We've entered a world where seeing is no longer believing. Erosion of trust. When we can't tell what or who is real, we stop knowing whom to trust. With billions of people now living in an AI-curated media bubbles, finding common ground is getting harder. But it's not all downside. AI has opened exciting possibilities in media. It made content creation more accessible, giving more people a voice. It translates and shares stories across languages and cultures, bridging gaps. It helps journalists analyze data, spot trends, and even expose corruption. It moderates some harmful content at a scale humans could never manage alone. Like any tool, AI can be used for good or ill, and that choice is ours. The critical question is how we design and employ it. Do we want media that merely maximizes engagement or media that fosters understanding? Do we want algorithms that reinforce our divisions or ones that introduce us to new ideas, new cultures, and different points of view? After all, media isn't just entertainment. It shapes public opinion, influences elections, and tells us who to trust and what to value. So here's the challenge for all of us. Are we using AI to stay informed or just stay comfortable? Are we in control of the stories we consume or are they quietly controlling us? The future of media is being written right now and it's up to us to decide whose voices get heard and what stories we tell.